welcome everyone, Farmer Cup here. It's gonna be a new mod map tour of Ball and Craig Extended. Uh, this is a map by EA Ben, McCormick X7080, and Chris6610. This is 141.04 megabytes to download, and it's currently for PC and Mac players only. Um, inside of the mod hub, it says uh, Bell and Craig is an extended, or Bell and Craig extended as a fictional map based on the heart of Northern Ireland. So there you go, you Irish uh, players out there, you have a good Northern Ireland map for you. This map includes static farm buildings. Uh, all animals are built into the map. Two cow farms and one sheep. There are 51. There are 51 that are most small in a few arable fields. I'm assuming they. Uh, I'm assuming the translation is just a little weird there, but it does say there are 51 that are. But anyhow, three farms, shop, one grain cell point, seasons ready, working lights and gates, um, and custom ground textures. So let's go ahead and take a look around here. Um, in the menu, we'll jump back to that in a second. That's all good there. Let's turn that down, that down, going across. There are contracts on the fields. Uh, let's see why no photo. Love it. Um, okay, going across. You start off with several pieces of equipment in the store there, or in the garage there. We have a few cell points on here, just a couple. Um, starting land in new farmer mode is this, and then also in this peripheral area for zero dollars. Bill 25 essentially in this one right here. So um, oh, it's a little expensive to get some of this stuff. So there's two, there's sheep and cows here and cows over here. So we'll take a look at those when we get there. Um, this will not take us, is there just nothing on those fields? Those are all grass fields, copy that, okay. So this will, I mean, we're probably not even gonna drive around this map. It's not gonna take us too long. We do have a trailer up there for some reason, but um, not gonna take us too long to go through this map. It's fairly small. If we go in the garage here. We have a Massey Ferguson 5610 we start off with, as well as a Case IH Mag, some uh, CVX 145, a TX32 Harvester, our farm tech trailer, a small uh, Stratman trailer, header for the Harvester, a cultivator, um, a small cedar set up there, a small slurry spreader, a small mower, small windrower, uh, bale wrapper, we have a baler, we have a feed mixer, water, and front loader with a couple of different attachments here. So we have a pallet fork, bale spike, and a bucket, a header trailer, and a couple of water stations on there as well. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and take a look around. Ooh, we're right on top of that. Is this a sleep trigger? Uh, we'll see here in a second. Let me turn the time up to noon, and let's give us a little bit more speed to go around. Um, okay, so farm area here. Uh, oh gosh. That looks horrendous. Oh man, how did this pass testing? Okay, anyhow, um, probably just needs an update. I mean, there's stuff like that that gets missed all the time, so I wouldn't look too into it. Maybe just wait for the update for it. Um, right here's the bunker cell. No, it's not. Okay, just wanted to double check there. Uh, but we do have different storage facilities here. So storages, storages. And this looks like maybe, is this maybe cows? One of the cow pens here? We'll do have some lights, looks like. So there we go, we can turn the lights on. Okay. Still looking for the dialog box here, if I can find it. There is one for this area. Hmm. I'm not having it come up for me. There's the feed areas, there's a dialog box. 500, holy smokes, it's a lot for that one. Uh, but at least there's one of the dialog boxes there. Open that up. Yeah, so some storage around the farm area. Oh, you have sheep here. That's right. It's not two cows. It's sheep and... Oops, get out of here. Oh, not that. That. There we go. Okay. Um, yeah, so not bad. There's some stuff stored around. It's a small little farmyard. A sleep trigger. Let me try to find that. There is one. I would indicate it would be right here. I'm not getting a sleep trigger to come up at all. Well, anyhow, no matter. There's plenty of things to fix that with. Uh, if we look at the map, we're going to run down to the shop and then we'll head back up, up over here. So yeah, we're just going to, again, we're just going to run there because it's not going to take us too long to walk around this map uh, to be completely fair because it's not that big of a map. And this is the road we need to take to get down to the shop, it looks like. Um, so yeah, just a small little map. We'll see most of them do the flyover. The flyover make it a little bit clearer to see and understand where we're going and everything like that. It's dark through here. Um, getting over here, the shop, up this road. Right here, shop trigger right there, as well. Sorry, I'm getting a new keyboard. I'm just trying to get used to it. Um, and as well as the escape key is literally way farther over to the left than it was before. Uh, but yeah, there we go. So shop trigger, repair trigger. And if we go a little further down this way, we have a fuel point right here. A little town set up here. Well, I try to get hit by a truck too bad. 
Um, we'll just walk up around this way. We could have actually taken this. Um, probably been a little bit easier, but that's okay. We'll walk up this way, and then this should take us theoretically straight up to where that trailer is, uh, that strange trailer, and up to the cell points, basically. It looks like most of the cell points are up at the top here. So I'm going to drink a coffee as we're running along here. Yeah, this should be a pretty quick uh, map tour just because there's not a ton going on. But, uh, yeah, our trailer is parked at this little structure here. So there's our trailer. We go a little further up. We're going to get to the animal dealer and our cell points, basically, it looks like. Any cell points anywhere else? Nope, they're all right here. So, right here, gate opens up. We have cell points and then animal dealer. Yep, animal dealer right there. Um, I'll open these guys up because they might have, looks like, yeah, maybe a cell point in there. Yeah, so let's go ahead and tag the cell points as we go through them here. Um, so, bail cell point. Is going to take they're going to take uh silage grass hay and straw and that's going to be right inside here if we back back out back into the menu here uh bolton's merchants is going to be right here and they are going to take um wheat barley no oats canola sunflower soy corn sugar beets potatoes and sugar cane and milk why do some maps just leave oats out entirely i don't know what it is about that and the spinnery is going to take your cotton and your wool and that is going to be right over here. So I guess there's not another one on this side. This is just a storage facility there. But uh, there you go. Those are your cell points, essentially. Uh, if we head back over this way, looking at the map here, we can head down to that other farm. Should be able to curve, I think, just to left here. This should start taking us that way. Yeah, this looks like this curves around. So, yeah, we'll just head up this way here, and this should run us right down. Uh, pretty close to the other cow pasture and fuel point down here. And we'll have seen the whole map. And we'll just do a flyover to just kind of finish off. I'm gonna drink a coffee. Go this way. Ooh, that looks like that needs a little bit of work there too. Yep, some of this stuff needs uh, definitely a little bit of a, a refresh. Uh, but here we are. Cow pasture here. 500 cows house. Easy to find that trigger. And then fuel trigger there. So yeah, let's go ahead and do a fly over this bad boy. I won't even need, honestly, that much speed. But yeah, so this is the whole map. You can see all of it. You can see the tree edges, which actually makes it super nice to be able to just kind of clearly see when you're in a fly through area of where the map ends. Um, yeah, so the edge isn't necessarily the best, I would say, but it works. Um, coming down here, again, up here at the top, actually, we'll just go back kind of how we went through. All of our cell points are... Um, Packed in, there's in our couple sheds here, but all of our cell points are packed in right over here. And as we head down, we have another little area with some sheds. But around here, we have the starting farm right here, so you can kind of get a good aerial view of that, as well as the shop down there. But that, I mean, that's that's all of it. So there you go. This might be your cup of tea. It may not be, but there you are. That is the Bell and Craig Extended. If you guys enjoyed this video, drop a like down below. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button up on the screen to join the Farmer Cop channel and turn on your notification bell so you don't miss any future videos I may post. This has been Farmer Cop. Thank you guys for coming and watching.